what's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to uh avoid or fix this problem if you have crashing or freezing problems in world of warcraft uh so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix these issues before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be a big support for me guys and it's free for you and would be um yeah it's just a support for my for my work or a little support for my work here on youtube i'm gonna thank you for that right now and i would just say let's get right started so the first app i would recommend doing for everybody is opening up the task manager by using your shortcut or going down to your taskbar right clicking it and opening it up so once it opened up i want you basically stick to processes and i know guys it's gonna sound a little bit weird just trust me i'm gonna explain it to you i want you to close every single tab or end every single task so why I'm uh, saying that, so these are two reasons for that. So first of all, uh, if you have a low-end PC or a bad PC, it could happen that too many programs at the same time could cause crashing or freezing because your PC can't handle that anymore, or it, will, it, is, it is like it was uh, for me. There are some programs, or applications, apps, whatever, which are going to third party your game, causing it to crash, causing it to freeze in some way. Don't ask me why, but it happens. And uh, by ending every single task, you're avoiding to have uh, this issue. So yeah, guys, so once you're finished here, you can close this one down. And next step is going to be to search an empty spot right onto your desktop. You're going to right click that and go to the bottom where it says display settings. Once the display settings pop up, I want you to stick right to your display and identify which your main monitor is. Obviously, this just suits or applies if you have more than one monitor. So once you identify that, you want to go down and stick right around scale and layout. We want you to go to change the size of text tabs and other items to 100% as recommended. And the display resolution should be the ga uh, same as in-game. So if you're having in-game like 1720 by 1070, I want you to apply this also in or on your display resolution. Once you finish here, I want you to close this one down and go to the bottom left corner of the screen, opening up your settings, navigating right onto update and security and sticking around Windows update. I know guys, this is going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me guys, it's going to work for you. You need to update your Windows in order to provide the best possible performance for your PC. So um, you're going to download the latest version of Windows and it will help you a lot. Once you're finished, I want you to close this one down and do the same thing for your graphics card. So if you have AMD or Nvidia, it doesn't really matter. Just download the latest version of that in order to provide the best possible performance for your PC in general. That's it for the video, guys. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. I'm sorry if I couldn't, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Leave me a like, leave me a subscription. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.